what's going on guys it's Brandon here with the Mizuno Wave Rider 22 and I'm on my fourth run in this shoe just did about five miles and now I'm relaxing kind of taking in my thoughts of what I think about this shoe so I can let y'all know how it feels um, first we'll go over a little bit of the tech specs on it and then we'll get into performance so tech specs we have obviously an engineered mesh upper very breathable it goes all the way around the side and I promise you you're gonna feel that especially if you, if you have moisture wicking socks this shoe is also actually moisture wicking it's gonna get all that off your foot um, you're gonna have a pretty dry pretty breathable run here big takeaway there and then um, the big part of it too with this shoe is not only does it have a lot of cushion but it's a 12 millimeter drop shoe so essentially it's gonna promote striking more towards your heel and that's where your uh, wave plate technology is gonna kick in so essentially we have soft foam euphoric cushioning up top we have a stiff wave plate, which is going to give you that responsive bounce back when you hit in your heel. It's going to pop, pop you forward. And then you have really, really, really soft cushioning back here, the euphoric X cushioning. We have really soft euphoric X cushioning in the back to kind of combat that. So you have soft, stiff, super soft. So it's going to give you a smooth ride and it's also going to give you that responsiveness. So it's really the best of both worlds. It's what most companies are going for nowadays. But Mizuno Wave Rider 22 is if obviously been doing it for a long time. They're still doing it really right. And when it comes to heel, or it comes to fit, sorry, here in the heel and around your ankle, it's, uh, I wouldn't say it's loose, but it definitely gives you a little bit of room to wiggle around in. So I liked it because I was kind of on a leisurely run and uh, I just didn't want to feel like super, super locked in. Um, there's not a ton of the support, or what's it called? Kind of the lockdown on the sides that's going to be kind of up to your lacing systems i know a lot of shoes they put the uh stitching here or something a midfoot cage to really secure your foot this is all about comfort i mean this shoe is all about comfort it's been around for a long time they haven't changed like a ton of things to make it completely different they're just subtly tweaking it every year making it better and this is all about comfort your foot's going to be really breathable on your runs you're going to have really soft cushioning and you're going to have that responsive ride I mean, this is definitely a racing shoe as well as a daily trainer. So if you like heel striking and if you like having a comfortable ride, I think that this is gonna be the shoe for you. Um, for whatever reason, if you try the shoe out and it is not the shoe for you, you decide. Roadrunner Sports, luckily our VIP family, we have a 90 day perfect fit guarantee. So go ahead and bring it back. Um, we'll put you in a shoe that we think might be a little bit better for you and we'll get you on your way and uh, we'll make sure that you have the right fit. I think that if you fall into the category of liking a ton of, what's it called, a ton of drop in your shoe and a ton of cushioning, neutral shoe, this one's going to be pretty hard to beat. So go ahead and check it out. Mizuno Wave Rider 22.